Friends will gather to remember Callie Burnett and her daughter Erin. It's been two weeks since they were found dead in Tangipahoa Parish. Since then, two people have been arrested for their murders. Rachel Hanley is at LaRanger High School where the vigil will be held tonight. And Rachel, this community has really rallied around the victim's family. Yeah, Whitney, they have. And what we keep hearing from people is that at this point, they really want people to remember who Callie and Aaron were and not the tragic way that they died. And tonight is going to be a big part of that. Like you said, I'm at Laurentia High School right now. This is actually where Callie Brunette graduated from high school. Tonight, the vigil is going to be held on the football field, which is behind me. Now, Callie Brunette was 35 years old. On June 13th, her father found her dead inside her home in Laurentia. Her four-year-old daughter, Aaron and Aaron's six-year-old sister were missing. A few hours later, sadly, the sister was found all right, but injured and Aaron was found dead. Now, Laurentia is a very small town, as people keep telling us, and Callie's family was very well known and have been here for many, many generations and held a, a large event called Old Farmers Day once a year. So a lot of people knew them and these deaths were just absolutely devastating and shocking for people. Now they started helping the family right away after this tragedy and a GoFundMe that they started has actually raised more than $60,000 so far. And so as we said, tonight was the vigil. This is going to be the first public event to remember Callie and Aaron so far. Uh, we spoke to an organizer just a second ago and she told us that the family just needed some more time to process it. So tonight the doors are going to open at 7 o'clock and then the actual vigil will start at 730. And again, this event is open to the public. In Laurentia, Rachel Handley, WWL Louisiana.